Thank you. 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 Thank
grab a coffee over ice. Like a, like a regular um, a drip coffee. Yeah. It's just like just like right, this drip of coffee. Yeah. And then uh, over ice. Yeah. Do you have ice coffee? Oh, is this like ice uh, drip coffee? Okay. With no sweetener in it. Okay. And then can you put one um, like pump of pumpkin? Uh, what size? Uh, grande. Thanks. So. Trying not to get some Would you like anything for milk? Uh, no.
filming. <laughs>
that you remember? Oh, me too. Yeah, I just remember that too. Yeah. Oh, spirit, yeah. Never done spirit before. It's very interesting. The, the seats are very thin. <laughs> I came off a southwest way. Uh, this one is, I had put like the like, batteries in all my luggage. And when we left, it still showed up my luggage or something. <laughs> no. <laughs> but you got it though, right? No, it was like, I guess it was under the plane, but it couldn't get us. Oh. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I was going to drop off my bags, but if it's this like, hectic trying to get out of here, I'm just going to go to the convention center and just get my badge. <laughs> just drop my bag off later, I guess. I was going to go to the let me just go get the bags. <laughs> yeah, because it's, it's getting late. We don't like, wanna... Tomorrow's going to be packed. Yeah. I was supposed to get here at 12.30, but my flight got delayed. So. Oh, well. I'll probably only use it if I'm at a convention. <laughs> so it's 
twenty-five dollars a month, and supposedly it's unlimited data, but we'll see. <laughs> unlimited to a cap. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm just like streaming at like really low bit rate and like low settings, and hoping that it'll go for as long as it can. And then I'll be using the Wi-Fi in the convention center. And I'm sure everyone else will too, so we'll see how that goes. <laughs> yeah, I followed you on Twitter too. I ended up getting like the 5G hotspot because I was like, I anticipate at the convention everyone's going to hop on the Wi-Fi and it's going to slow it down. Yeah. Yeah, I thought about getting a hotspot, but I was just like, you know what, I already... I got this phone special. Yeah. It's a cheap little Samsung phone. It's like $200. Um, and then I got the phone plan. And I was like, you know what? I can't. I, I can't. <laughs> I, I was like buying equipment. Like, I need to like, relax. And, all that. and I was like, is it even worth it? <laughs> I know. I need to relax.
black card. I know, it's very confusing. <laughs> There's like a Blink 182 concert that's happening. see what they have mm -hmm. just for like a few hours and then friendship bracelet I give to somebody because um, I made some extras. I made some for people that I knew were going to
what is the um, public ter service, public transit system called? It's like, um, Excuse me. Do you know what the <laughs> bus system is called? There's like a tram or like a. What? It's like a train or something that goes around. The monorail. The, the, like the the loop. They called the Vegas Loop or something. Is it not the monorail or? Maybe it's the monorail. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, there's like some kind of train tram thing that goes around the whole thing and you just hop on and hop off and hop on and hop off. <laughs> I don't know where that's at though. But there's a stop right there at the convention center um, at the West Hall. So maybe that will save some money. <laughs> I don't know. Looking at like a person or a driver and it's like fucking a hundred dollars an hour. Jeez. I'm like, not bad, I'm like, Yeah. It's crazy. I wish I had that kind of money. <laughs> <laughs> I used lose spirit because it was like a hundred dollars cheaper than Southwest. <laughs> yeah. And it was a little bit uncomfortable, but I met a really nice lady from Germany named Claudia and her husband named Russell. I was stuck in between the two of them <laughs> because that's where the, the, the seat was. I, I've never tried like Spirit because like I've heard me too. like bad reviews from the customers and all that. Yeah, me too. So I was like really nervous. It wasn't that bad. The seats are very thin. Like they're literally that thick. Like the seat that you sit on, it's like the back is like that thick. Um, and you can feel the ground under you when they're going on the runway and everything. And you can definitely hear more of like the flying sounds because there's like less insulation, but it's not that bad, especially for such a short flight. Um, because it's just like an hour and a half. We got here kind of fast because I mean, from Sacramento to like LA, it, I mean, it's like the same duration, like an hour and a half. Yeah, San Diego but too. Flying here seemed a lot faster than to LA. Well, I think we're going forward in time or something. Uh, I think, isn't Arizona one hour ahead? It's like mountain time or something. I don't remember. I can't remember. But, um, yeah, I know that when I go to PAX East, sometimes, I've only gone twice, but it was fun. <laughs> um, then the flight seems faster going there, but then on the way back, it's like ages. It feels like 12 hours. <laughs> because, like, you're going back through the time zones. So maybe. But isn't, like, Vegas specific? I, I'm not sure. I thought it was mountain time. Maybe I'm thinking of Reno. Something is Probably. mountain time. Because it feels like the time went really fast. Like it was 12, and then all of a sudden it's 3. I'm a little confused. It was funny because I had booked my flight for like 5 a.m. Mm -hmm. And then I was like debating, I was like, if I take that, get here at six, it's gonna be like 10 hours that I would have to spend just in Vegas. Gosh. So I moved my flight to like 12 p.m. That's and I good. came at nine, you know, just so I could get through TS, um, TSA and all that. Uh -huh. And then I was like waiting still like six hours. Oh, that's horrible. Four, I think four hours by then. Yeah, mine was four hours too. I, Cause I, I took a train down to Sacramento and um, yeah, the, the train left at like four and then I got there at seven. I don't know how that worked, but I think it got delayed or something. Um, but. Well, Southwest was having like some sort of issue today where they, like all the flights were delayed by like maybe yeah, 30 minutes. Too. Spirit 2, it, we were supposed to leave at 11.44, but it was left at 12.12 12 instead. Yeah, I was there since, I've been, I mean, like I said, we both haven't slept. <laughs> I took a nap on the floor in the airport because I was so tired. I just found a little corner that had a wall and it was like, okay, I'm just going to sleep over here for a minute. There was even someone who was like, oh, look at that poor girl. She's sleeping on the floor. <laughs> I heard somebody say that behind me. I was like in my seat trying to like shut my eyes for a bit to get some like shut eye. Uh -huh. 
and then I'm like over here holding this backpack, holding my sweater, and <laughs> my drone. <laughs> I'm like holding on to it and it slips and then it like wakes me up and all that. But I was like holding on to it because I was like, I don't want someone just walk off with my equipment and shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would have gotten to sleep on the plane, but Claudia was talking to me about all of her adventures <laughs> and how it's her birthday tomorrow and they're going to go see the Cirque du Soleil thing. And it's just such a nice conversation. I didn't want to be like, okay, can you be quiet so I can go to sleep? <laughs> yeah, she's really sweet. got to the airport at 7 and then we left on the plane at 12. So I was there for 5 hours. <laughs> so I don't know if Spirit's worth it um, because yes, I saved $100 but um, I paid for it with time <laughs> and <Yeah>. exhaustion. <laughs> This is gonna be fun trying to get back to the airport. <laughs> I hope there's like a monorail or something that we just didn't find because of all the chaos. Do, do you know try the if there's a Tesla loop thing that they were? Yeah. But I guess it's only around the convention center or something. fast in the bit where I can't keep up. <laughs> it's kind of funny. So are you on like 4G or 5G streaming? Um, I... Spots just for like the, the GoPro, mm -hmm. but I'm like, okay, if that runs out of data, I'm just gonna use my cell phone data yeah. to, to see if that even works. Yeah, because I think I've tried IRL streaming before from my hotspot on my phone, mm -hmm. but it like drops in and out. I'm like, never mind, it's not even worth it. <laughs> yeah, I've used the, the Streamlabs app before. Um, and I like that, but this is the IRL Pro app um, that like Ginny, TTY, and Joey, and um, Extra Emily, and everyone, they use this app. And it? it's only on um, Android phones, unfortunately. But so I, that's why I had to get one. Uh, it doesn't let you do scenes. That, the, all of that is um, with a server. It's a, called the SRT server. You have to like pay a monthly fee for it. But if you look up um, IRL.tv or something like that, 
um, or if you just type in like SRT server or um, there's something else but I just can't remember what it's called but um, yeah those are it, that's like a separate thing that you have to pay for and I'm not going to pay for that <laughs> I want someone else to have it and I will leech off of theirs <laughs> because it's like a hundred dollars a month and I don't stream that much on IRL so it's like silly <laughs> I ended up bringing my laptop and the, like in the bigger bag, there's this, another backpack like empty. Mm -hmm. But I was like, okay, I'm gonna throw the laptop in there, two big power banks, one for the laptop, one for the camera, the hot, <laughs> mobile hotspot, and bam. Nice. <laughs> but let's see if it works. <laughs> yeah. Good luck. I hope it does. Yeah, I don't know, stream is really confusing. It's a lot better than it used to be, because it used to be like really hard to do anything unless you had a backpack, but now... Um, yeah, because they were saying there's the IRL, because I guess it has antennas that connect to like the best tower or whatever. Yeah, and they, they have this thing called bonding too, where they they take like T-Mobile and Verizon and AT&T and they put it all into one signal. This app does that, um, the IRL Pro app. It has it built in. Um, show you. It's really cool. Um, but it's got this bonding thing and then um, it will bond the cellular and the Wi-Fi and if I had one like Ethernet connection. Um, it's really cool. Yeah it's just called IRL Pro on the App Store. Um, but yeah it's kind of sucky it's only on Android. I wish they had a iPhone one. But what can you do? At least there's something that's like a little bit more professional. <sighs> I wish I had another uh, phone service but I just I don't want to pay like a bunch of money you know because it's like I only have a few people so it's just kind of silly. <laughs> like me I mean, I have viewers, but they're not there all at the same time. It's yeah. like they're sporadic. It's like not consistent. Yeah. So it's like you've got a lot of people. Like I, I probably have like 100 people who watch the streams, but they're not all there at the same time. So it winds up being less. Yeah. Um, and then it's like, they'll tell me like, when are you going to stream? And I'm like, look, I I'm not a streamer. All the time. <laughs> I'm like, look, I'm not a streamer. I'm just streaming. Because, like, I do um, web development. Like, nice. I'm making a chat bot that is slightly a little bit better than Nightbot and okay. Stream Elements. Um, so, I'm working on that, and they're like, How come you don't stream? And I'm like, Look, I'm not a streamer, I'm a developer. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I only stream so I could test my app. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, there used to be something that was like Nightbot, but better. It's called Deepbot. Um, I'm sure you've probably heard of that. I think it's still around. Yeah, I used to use it. It was nice. But then it just started to get buggy and it just felt like old because everything else was like web based and Deepbot was the only one that you had to like install on your computer and it was like local and everything. Because yeah, like the one I'm making is like web based but <laughs> it has different features than like the other ones because like I had made this thing where. It looks at who's lurking in the chat, right? Mm -hmm. And then it checks if they're actively following, and if they're not, then it prompts in the chat, like, um, hey, Caribel, <laughs> thanks for lurking in the chat. Uh, please consider following, blah, blah, blah. That's awesome. So it does that. It announces, like, the unfollowers, like, people who unfollow. Mm -hmm. um, it has, like, all the chat alerts and all that. Like, the, there's a lot more that I put into it, but I can't even remember, like, everything I put into it. Yeah. Oh, maybe that's at West Convention Center. Which one? It says West Convention Center, but maybe it's a different one. Yeah. Hmm. Um. Yeah, that sounds really cool. I'm always down for testing stuff. I really wanted to be like a professional beta, beta tester for like video games and stuff or like you get to get paid to like like a bug Dude, tester bugs. yeah, yeah. cuz i always find bugs like the game will be perfectly done and it's released 
and it costs like $60 and you get it and then I will find every single bug <laughs> that's left over. I don't know why. I just, I, I get really lucky and I, I guess I just search every nook and cranny of every part of that game and then I find all the bugs. <laughs> There is one that is called Vampire, and at the very end, there's like this really dramatic scene where like the the bad guy is actually a lady, and she um, is like really angry, and she's like pouring her heart out to the the hero, and he's just like, oh, like I feel so bad, and she's just like jerking around like this the whole time that she's saying this speech. <laughs> it just looks so funny. It's like that doesn't like. Like, I, I feel like we're supposed to be sad and, like, wanting to cry. And she's just, like, dancing. <laughs> it was so funny. Yeah. Well, the last time I was in Vegas was when I was, like, eight. Really? That's <laughs> cool. I've never been here before. It's, like, very... I don't know. It, it reminds me of, like, Sacramento and San Diego and stuff. Like, it, it feels very modern, but the sun is so bright. Has like the elevation or something. So I was telling my friends, I'm like, yeah, we're not going outside, we're staying inside. <laughs> I know. I put sunscreen on just in case, but I'm, I'm going to try to stay inside as much as I possibly can because I don't want to get sunburned. Hi, yeah. <sighs> Jamaican. Sorry about that, Mount. I think it's the freeway. When we go too fast, it's like the bit right can't keep up. So what do I call you? Do I call you PC boy? Or do I, like, what um, is your... Everyone just calls me PC. PC? Okay. Cool. Thank you, Ara. <laughs> Count on your pins. <laughs> Is this the Tears of the Kingdom one? It's so cool. I think there's like a few of them. Yeah, the, just awesome. the sword. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really cool. It's like I have bought them to put them on the lanyard, uh, <laughs> but until I get it, I just put them there. Yeah. Well, double check to make sure they're all there when I leave because <laughs> <laughs> my sweater sort of got caught on one of them. Yeah, it did. <laughs> I don't want to take off with one of your pins and it fall on the ground. It'd be so sad. Because <laughs> they're cool. I like the little Spongebob doodle bob thing too. It's cute. I'll go if there's like a dedicated party, but I'm not gonna wander around by myself. <laughs> yeah, but I think most of the like attractions close, like business hours. That's so true. Like that. This is like we're here, might as well, you know. Yeah. Like, That's why I got my coffee. I'm just like pushing through it. I'm tired, but I'm drinking coffee. <laughs> my nap really helped too. I was exhausted. Ooh, that's a cool hotel. Look at that. 
the resort world. Very cool. Oh, and there's the sphere! Look at that! Isn't this supposed to be on? Be what? Isn't this supposed to be on like during the day? Yeah, I think it is on. It, it had like some kind of um, like little shiny thing that was on it. Oh my gosh, look at that! There's a Ross. That's nice. The gold... The gold kitty? The gold key. K-T-Y shops. Oh, the gold key. <laughs> I'm getting my vibes. I don't care how long it takes. I'm getting it today. And you should get it today too because the lines are going to be crazy the rest of the weekend. Yeah. And you don't want to stand in that when you're just trying to go in. Do you know if they're going to have like any big artists like for the party and all that? Because you know how like last year they had um, Megan. Yeah. I, so it's at the, what's it called? The little area 15 I think. Yeah. 51 or 15. Yeah. Um, so I think it's and did you go to um, Long Beach, TwitchCon? They had like this carnival um, on the Queen Mary cruise ship. Um, and it, it wasn't a running cruise ship. It was like a retired cruise ship that they turned into this haunted carnival thing. It was really cool. I think it's going to be like that um, party where it's just kind of a free-for-all. You can kind of go around and do little activities and eat food and stuff. Because how... Um, the carnival one was it, they had like a bunch it was kind of like haunted the uh universal studios for nights so um was it actually different. the what do they call it because the queen mary has this like haunted night kind of crap mm -hmm. i think that's probably what it was yeah they they just they booked the whole um cruise ship for the night that's what twitchcon did um and it's really cool because it's only twitch goers <laughs> And um, yeah, it's I think that was like nice. before I got into Twitch. Yeah, I think it, it was 2017, 16 or 17. Yeah, because yeah, that was 17. like funny because like during that time I used to live in Long Beach. Oh man! And I was thinking about going, but I was like, what is what is Twitch? Yeah, it was beautiful. I love Long Beach. I was sad that they only did it the one year because Long Beach was like really nice. It was very small, but the ocean was like right there, and it just felt cozy. There's the convention center! And oh my there's gosh. the lions. It's not that bad. <laughs> it's just food trucks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's cops. That's fun. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> Look at TwitchCon right there. That's where we're going. It's so exciting. But yeah, we should definitely get our badge today, like as soon as possible because man, the lines are just constantly so bad the rest of the days. I would have gotten my badge yesterday, but that was only for partners and press. Um, so I was like, I'll just go on Thursday, <laughs> save some money. I was actually planning on flying in tomorrow, mm. and I'm like, let me just do it now, mm -hmm. get it out of the way. Yeah, otherwise you'd spend half the day in the line, because that is one thing that Twitch still has not figured out, is how to combat the lines, because like TwitchCon has like the longest lines I've ever seen, like, even compared to like PAX and stuff, like so, all of the meetups and everything, like the lines are so long. Why do they make you get it here and why not mail it to you? I don't know. Because like, PAX mails it to you. And PAX is way bigger than TwitchCon. But maybe they're worried that I'll get like um, lost and they, they want to confirm that you're actually the person. Um, okay. Cool. Thank you. Thank you so much.
Sure. Thank you. Okay, make sure I have everything. Thank you. You know which way they're gonna be carrying that kind of thing? Um, that just. Oh, I'm not sure exactly, but I figure if we go over there, there will be somebody who will tell us. <laughs> Trying to get a jaywalk. No, right? Me neither. Sure. Maybe you just cross. That other side of the line over there looks kind of scary, yeah. though. Cross. I just didn't want to. Miss you. Uh, maybe that light down there has a cross on maybe? Conventions. Make friends with everybody. So easy. So fun. <laughs> so it says that that's the staff exhibitor entrance, but he said that it's down on the left. <sighs> I'm so glad I brought a hat. Okay, thank you. Can we, can we go through this way? You can okay. go that way. Cool. I'd stick to the sidewalk. Okay, thank you. It looks faster if we go this way. sunscreen stick. I feel like it's not enough. Are you going to badge pickup? Yeah. Yeah, cool. We're going there too. <laughs> We're trying to figure it out. <laughs> Look at it's the sphere, it's right there. That is as close as we're gonna get to it because it costs money to go in. <laughs> you walk up to it. Oh really? Yeah. Although it's kinda of far. <laughs> yeah. Although it's 
I live here, but I can tell you, traffic up there, even pedestrian traffic, is terrible. Yeah? Yeah, because you got all these people walking in and out, you know, so they first got, you have to cross streets to get there, and it's all up all the Ubers and taxis. It's, it's a madhouse. Yeah, it's horrible getting from the airport. I'm so grateful to this guy, Mr. PC, over here, because I wouldn't have left for five hours. <laughs> it's crazy. No, I wouldn't have been able to leave <laughs> because of the line over there. Like, that's crazy. The surge pricing hits. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know, like, for me, I hate cleaning, so I was just like, just give me the dab over. Yeah. That was so cheap. I would have waited until it went to no price. <laughs> so. I know. So bad. I like what an umbrella. Is my lips out? Yeah, my lips are out. Oh, I need sunscreen on my lips. Okay. Badge pickup. That way. They said to go past the food trucks. I wanted to stay there. My mom said that she had a coworker who said that you have to stay at Circus Circus. But that was like $300 a night. That's, that's way too much. Why is there anything good over there? No, it's just, apparently they've got like free circus shows every night that come included with your room and stuff. And, and it's like not exactly kid friendly, but like closer to kid friendly. Circus tent over there. <sighs> it's so close. Maybe we'll walk over there one of these days. <laughs> Have some extra time. Okay. Are you affiliate? Are you affiliate? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. mob lord he's like the salsa guy he's like famous for having salsa and he's just community member he doesn't stream <laughs> hey you're totally fine first thing i'm gonna do is go to target and get some sunscreen yeah get sunscreen and a hat 
I know it looks dumb, but it, it actually is helping me so much. I want to get some sun gloves, too. I saw Jenny was wearing them, and I was like, dude, that is so smart. Where did you get those from? <laughs> My poor hands. I put sunscreen on them, but I don't know. <laughs> I'd share if it wasn't, like, a stick. No, it's fine. <laughs> I don't think you want my face germs on your face. <laughs> Can we just go through there? No, please go. No, okay. I know, they won't let us though. <laughs> Everybody have your QR code and ID ready for me. Hello, Mr. Platypus. Hello, Mr. Platypus. Hey, nice to see you guys. I haven't seen you in a minute. I know, it's been forever. I just want to say hi. Yeah, no worries. Yeah. I hope you will. I'll see you soon. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Confirmation. If you just type TwitchCon Vegas 2023, it should pop up. It'll be like one of the emails that they sent. No, you did. Everyone did. It is so hot. I'm so glad you guys have shade. <laughs> Okay. Thank you. You too. Thank you. Can I get a different one? Can I get a different one? This one's not opening. Oh, what are Find it? Yeah, I got it. Street, it looked kind of interesting. I'll find something. Okay. 
can probably just gonna uh, walk around for I want a drink. Yeah, let's get some water. Do you know where like they have drinks? I, I don't know, but sure if someone knows. Sorry? Are you guys lying for a No. Uh, no. Okay. We think there was fish over here. Yeah. Do you know where we could get some water at? Do you know where we could get some water at? I'm looking for the same thing. Oh. Okay. I think they got them. I don't know. I have no idea, so I'm so sorry. It's okay. If you, if you really want, you can ask the people up front where the police is at. Okay. They probably know more than me about the water. Okay, thank you. I, I hope someone brings you water. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get some in a minute. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm going to. Sure. Okay. <laughs> you need to stay hydrated. It's so hot out here. Yeah, I'm gonna try and get my friend in a minute. Yeah, I'm gonna ask her really quick. Hi. I was just wondering, do you know where we can get some water? Hi. Uh, do you know where we can get some water? Trying to find the QR code. Okay. Are you cool with drinking out of my cup? Um, I don't have diseases. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, yes, yes. They have, they have a cup. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I think I got it. Can I get one more? Okay. I'm gonna offer it to the guy that okay. needs water. He might not take it, but maybe he will. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. I bring the gift of water. Oh, I appreciate it. You're Thank welcome. You. Wow, that was nice. No problem. She, she just gave us a... Right, Thank you. <laughs> okay. I, I'm okay on water. I've got a, a bottle. I should probably have some of it. So what else is there to do right now? Uh, let's sit in the shade for a second. bottle that I have refilled like 12 times today. <laughs> I just want to sit down too. Oh, could you have water too? Emergency water. <laughs> when it's hot as fuck. <laughs>
like a bone there, or like they don't uh, have they, they have like, you can go in if you're press and stuff for like the preview. Um, at one year I snuck in, because the doors were open, and they are like, yeah, just go on in. Uh, but, um, there wasn't anything to do. They were just setting up. It was just, you know, half belt booths. That was it. But yeah, if you can get to like Target or something and get one of these little sunscreen sticks, this is like lifesaver. This is really good. I found it out from um, Universal Studios because I paid for the VIP experience one time. Um, I was only there for one day and I'd never been and I wanted to see all the things. And they gave me a sunscreen stick and I was like, dude, this is so nice. <laughs> So I just kept putting it on the whole day, and it was a like clear sunscreen too, so it's way better than this one. <laughs> um, and yeah, it was awesome. Uh, I'm like sweating, but I don't want to take my sweater off, because if I do, then I'm going to get sunburned. <laughs> I look like a scarecrow with this hat and my